Welcome back. Singapore authorities are concerned about the rising number of deaths at work sites of smaller construction projects, which typically attract smaller contractors. The Manpower Ministry says this is a relatively new trend and is looking at ways to tackle the problem. Five deaths have occurred at sites for projects less than $10 million in contract value this year. And that's almost double compared to the whole of last year. Minister of State Zaki Mohammed shared these findings after an inspection today. Geraldine Yap with more. A surprise inspection at this work site along Ang Mo Kio Avenue 5 uncovered multiple lapses. They included a lack of guardrails at open sites, unsafe scaffolding, and construction materials not placed properly. The contractor, Sia Construction, had previously been issued composition fines and notices of non compliance. A stop work order has been issued here at this work site and it will be in effect for at least three weeks. During this time, the contractor will have to take several steps to address safety lapses, including conducting refresher training for workers and re auditing its safety management systems. This site visit is the first of 400 inspections of high risk workplaces to be conducted until mid February next year, with over half at construction sites. Uh, we typically look out at issues um, such as uh, working at height. Um, because it's something that's very common at uh, construction sites because it's typically high rise. The other issue is in terms of scaffolds, scaffolds uh, where workers are actually required to also work at height, uh, doing external works uh, on the facade of the building. Uh, the other issue is in terms of form works, uh, where, which are not done properly, uh, they may have the, the risk of collapse. Official figures show that 14 construction workers died on a job so far this year, including four in November alone. That's the same number for the whole of 2018. The number of deaths at work sites for smaller projects also went up. Industry insiders say such projects tend to attract smaller firms and subcontractors. The challenge with the smaller sites is that there are a lot more of them compared to the larger ones. And certainly with uh, smaller firms too, um, they, may have, they may lack the resources or know-how. And this is where we must also come in to do both, not just enforcement, but also education awareness. And at the worker level, our efforts will continue. Singapore aims to reduce workplace fatalities to one death per 100,000 workers by 2028. As of end June this year, the rate was 1.2 per 100,000 workers.